Many of you will not be successful because you've got this giant goal and no steps to go with it. You're just in your mind like, girl, this is my year. How many steps? I don't know. Like, what is it going to take for you to do it? I don't know. I just know this is my year. All of us in life have things we want. We don't get what we want. We get what we have to have. We all get what we tolerate in ourselves and other people. But when you're no longer willing to tolerate something, that's when your life changes. The difference in people is their standards, period. Everyone in the world has a list of things they think they should do. I should lose weight. I should work out. I should work harder. I should make more calls. I should, I should, I should, I should. And then you know what? People don't do their shoulds and they get mad at themselves and they what I call should all over themselves. They beat themselves up about it. What changes people is when your should becomes a must. When suddenly the thing you said should happen has to happen. That's when human beings change. It's like if you want to take the island, burn the boats. Because if there's no way to go back, it's amazing what happens when it's a must to do something versus a should. The number one thing that's going to change your life, the only thing that will change your life, change your business, change your money, change your relationship, is you must raise your standard. If you can't stick to something for five fucking days, you deserve to have a shitty life. You deserve to get your ass kicked. You deserve to be miserable. We're talking about five fucking days. We're not talking about 50 years. We're not talking about the five years it probably takes to build something worthwhile. We're not talking about the five months it could take for you to lose 100 pounds. We're talking about five fucking days. And you can't even stick to it for that. So what the f*** do you think you deserve? You deserve exactly what you get. And that's the truth. That's the things your friends won't tell you when you're bitching and moaning about how your life sucks on Friday night, drinking a f***ing brewski with your boys. When you should be reading or improving or working out or f***ing doing something. If you can't start to tell the choice that you have in your head to sit the f*** down and shut up, you're going to have a very hard time making any year your year. What it's always going to come down to is your own actions and your own choices. This is your year. You're here for change. It's time to make that change right now. It doesn't matter if it's the first, the second, the third, the first week, the second week. It's the new year. You have new opportunities. There's new doors opening for you every single day. You have to just walk through them and be who you were meant to be on this earth.